Hello everybody and welcome back to Random Redstone. Now in this episode we are, in my view, doing the most, like, the m most breakthrough bit of Redstone that I've ever seen. It is, in well, simply amazing really. I do we have to ages to work out a way to do it, but uh, I've worked out a way now and you'll be able to transfer it to all your Redstone projects. So pretty much, it's, it looks weird, but what this is, is it is one Redstone wire that can actually send multiple signals. Now, stay with me. I know you're probably thinking, Bob, stop being crazy. Stop being stupid, all right? I'll prove it. There you go. Both of those going straight into that one redstone dust, all right? Okay. Just so you know, I'm not, I'm not kidding, right? So right, let's test this first one. Only the first one goes on, right? Okay. This is no tricky like, camera editing tricks or anything. Just the second one goes on. All right? You say you want both on? All right, there you go. Both are on. There you go. And all of it is because of this system. It is literally smart redstone. Redstone that is designed to have multiple signals going through one redstone dust. And it works. It took me around about three hours to work out how to do this. But this will save tons of redstone. Just imagine having like one trail of redstone for, for things like two doors. Instead of having to worry about two trails for two doors. It will save you tons of redstone. So, pretty much there is just simple redstone. It's just repeaters going into this thing. It is really, really simple as that. And let's go have a look at the redstone of this thing. So, as you can see, it's repeater based. And, well, that's mainly because re repeaters are my favorite, one of my favorite items of redstone. You can do so much with them. So, let's just pretty much see like the basic thing, how it works. So, I'll put, I'll put this one on, just so we can see how it works. Okay, so... Pretty much what happens here, it, this works perfectly actually, is if it's just to here, this system will actually register it, such as if the energy only goes to here, then it goes straight through and only powers this system. If it goes all the way to here, it will only power this system, because this system is instantly disabled, as you can see here, because there's the obsidian going across it there. So this entire system pretty much registers how far a signal goes. The only downside is from here all the way to here has to be 15. Has to be 15 or the system will not work. Now, I know you're probably thinking, Bob, you idiot, you've now made it so it's only like certain distance. Yes, but at the same time, this thing also works as a as actually extender at the same time. All you have to do is get the rest and then literally put a dust going along there and then send it to the next one. It is actually as simple as that. It really is. It is this really awesome system. And in my view, it is going to change the world of redstone forever. It is seriously amazing. I've already like messed around with this. I've made like the redstone TV that's over there. I had a little mess around and I made it so all the controls, every last one of them, is using this system. It, in my view, yeah, it's going to change the redstone world forever. Because this thing, it's, it is one redstone wire... But yes, it controls two signals. It is just, it is mind-boggling, really. So turn that one off. So there we go. Turn that one on, and it is literally. There is nothing you can't do with this. Well, obviously, if you activate that one first, this one automatically gets disabled, so you can't turn it on. But apart from that, you can literally do them in any order. So you can have them on both on if you want to have them that way. You can have them both on, or you can have just this one on, or you can have just that one on. If you want both of them on, you do have to make sure you do them in that order, as the other order will not work, unfortunately. I'll, I'm going to try and work out a way to do it without having to worry about that, but yeah, until then, it is literally two redstone signals via one redstone wire. Now, I need to come up with like a name for this kind of system. So, what, what kind of name do you think I should have it? Um, hmm... What kind of name? Just trying to think, because I'm at the moment trying to think of like a decent name, because it is, it is seriously a completely 100% new system that will, well, a lot of people are probably going to use this, so I want it to, I want it to be a name that sounds cool. Um, hmm. Um, um what, 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 let me just have a look at the redstone here. Let me have a look. Um, what does it look like? It's got a H. So what words can we think of to do with H? Because it's pretty much got the repeaters in a H formation. Um. Let's have a let's have a thing. Well, it's pretty much like a control. So it's literally well, it's pretty much like a microcomputer. Pretty much. Um, what should we call it? Um, 
I don't know. I'm trying. I'm trying to think of like a decent name for the circuit. Um, let me, I don't know. Let me know in the comment section below. If I can't come up with them by the like the end of this video, let me know in the comment section below, and I'll and I'll pick the best one out for the new circuit. Because this this circuit, I th I think is absolutely like amazing. Obviously, make sure that one's on the was on the second tick, and make sure this one is on the third tick. So then that way, both of these signals go out at the same time. So yeah, it is. It is more well, amazing. It is a it is a pretty much like a multi redstone core. So yeah, that's what that's what I call it a multi redstone core. There you go. Yeah, a multi redstone core, which is amazing because it can carry two signals. If like if like you wanted to carry more, then all you have to do is adapt this system for more. I'll if you want me to do a video on that, then make sure you let me know in the comment section below, and I'll happily make a video showing you how to make like like three, four, five, maybe even six, all from one redstone trail. It is absolutely amazing. So yeah, a, a multi redstone trail. So yeah, I hope this helped you absolutely massively with your builds, because it helped me an absolute lot. So yeah, until next time, bye!